scroll hijacking used to be really, really difficult to do. But now with Framer, you can do an interaction like this one with just a couple of clicks. Here you can see that I have my three sections stacked on top of each other. Delete that. You just need one with components and variants inside of it. Now that I've done that, I'm gonna take the entire section and set the position to sticky. Make sure that when you're setting position to sticky inside of Framer, you set the parent containers to be overflow set to visible. From there, we're gonna create a couple of frames down below and give them a scroll section ID. These are gonna be the sections that everything scrolls up and down through. Then all we have to do is set up a magical scroll variant animation that just says when a specific section is in view that we want to rotate the variant from one to another and we can control as many sections and as many variants as we want to. When you do that, you get this really cool scroll hijacking animation in less than a couple of minutes. If you want to learn more about scroll hijacking, watch the full video over on YouTube. Hey, you know, I actually feel a little better.